presentation, Icon's Army are behind you. Thank you all for this opportunity. Peace. Hi everyone, my name is Ola Bola Jairo Benja Bikas and I'm here repping my girl Lucy mm. of the Lucidation Gang. Thanks to God, we the girl just do you experience the house, have fun with the other housemates and thank you for Nigeria for this opportunity. It's one thing to see it and imagine and then it's another thing for you to hear it from the host's mouth. Hello guys, welcome back again to my YouTube channel. My name is Vicky and if you've seen me for the very first time, hi! Please consider to hit on the red subscribe button and subscribe to my YouTube channel and do not forget to turn on your notification bell so that YouTube will inform you whenever I post a new video. And please give this video a thumbs up, leave me a comment in the comment section. I really love to read from you guys, both negative and positive. Please leave your comment in the comment section and please guys, Go check me out on my personal channel. Like I've always told you guys, not only I'm a boy and a proper actually, I sabi do, I sabi do other things. And on that channel, I do videos on family, lifestyle, and vlogs, and every other interesting videos in between. Please, guys, the name of the channel is Vicky M. The link is always in the description and pinned in the comment section. Please go support your girl. For those of you who just want to support me, who like me, who just feel like, okay, let me support her hustle here on YouTube. This is the time for you to show it. Oh, crrr. thank you guys because I know you are absolutely going there to do the needful you get. So, guys, moving on. Guys, hmm. A lot of things are happening in that house so see a lot of times i have come here to report to you guys what has been happening under the sheets between erica and kid why i have some videos on my channel where you see them doing one thing or the other you know some of them are doing fellowship some are doing they are doing prayer some they are doing gathering august meeting whatever you guys call it that they do under the sheet there whether they are praying or whatever they are doing but like last night Erica used her mouth by herself to confess to Neil in the kitchen that she has done the, the she has done everything with kid wire from sex to blow job to everything like from her mouth that is what she actually confessed to Neil in the kitchen and I'm like Jesus Christ this girl she does not know what she's even saying it is better it is left in our imagination than she confessing it to Neil like she just did they think they, they, they show videos of what it is that happened in that end of us now. This is a, I don't want to watch. Oh, no joke. I'm so embarrassed. No joke. I just ate everything. Every single thing, right? I mean, 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 Guys, did you hear that? I'm sure I'm not the only one that heard that. And this one coming from the horse's mouth, telling you, and she's even saying like, oh, she knows it to be out there, but she shouldn't be heard in the house. That even she will be embarrassed by what she has done. Ah, Jesus Christ. Even myself, as I, as I hear this, and I'm like, oh, God, Erica, you're talking too much. It was better we were imagining than you to confirm it. You shouldn't have. But funny enough, she did. And nothing is definitely hidden under the sun and that was it and then talking about she kissing lakon the whole controversy that has been happening between she and lakon the whole drama the whole anger the whole quarreling that has been happening to lakon even if she lakon has told her before as in when she did it in the party funny enough praise who has been evicted actually granted an interview and was asked the same question and he said that yes it is true that erica actually tried kissing Lakon and him praise he actually he also tried telling her in the morning that ah this is what you did this is what you did and this is what you did morning that you tried to kiss Lakon I told her I said Erica you tried to kiss Lakon and she was like no I'm like yes people did a lot of things in the party that I would tell them in the morning and they'd be like yeah. no we didn't do it it's a lie so I saw it happen and I said it to her face and I said it to Lakon they were there they were both there when I said it I said, Erica, you tried to kiss Lekon in the party. I'm no snitch. I'm not scared of anybody. I'm the kind of guy, I'm a stand-up guy. I will yes. tell you straight to your face. Mm. And then, funny enough, I'm wondering why is Erica denying the whole thing? Because as it is, I, I saw when Lekon was telling her, and she was like, really? Did I do that? And 
as yes you were intoxicated so there was no need denying it and getting pissed off like what he said was a lie but whatever it is i don't want yeah, people to start coming for me that i'm being biased because i am not i am just reporting it to my big stars the way it is as he did hot you get me so moving on guys also finally finally has professed love to nengi <laughs> I don't know what else to say or what else to do. Oh, no. I just feel like maybe, like, only time and time. I'm serious, like, this is your own one. I come serious, like, I don't know if I need to jump or fly or swim. Mm -hmm. No, but it's true, no, I'm serious. Like, this, I want this one and everything, all right? So the stupid girl, the way she, <laughs> the way she even responded, Steph and Nengi knew they even try. I don't know what's wrong with Nengi. At some point there, I don't understand how much Nengi, how long Nengi is really gonna suppress this thing that I feel she feels. I don't think she feels anything anyway. But also has finally, and I just felt so pity, so much pity for him because for the longest time. Ozo has been following Nengi about. In fact, Ozo's whole existence is around Nengi because you will see him following Nengi. He does everything with Nengi. He cannot stay 30 minutes without being around Nengi. And you just see, I just, in fact, the whole follow follow thing, eh? you just make me come the pity. And well, today he has succeeded in telling her what he feels about her. And her response was just funny. Instead of she to talk something, she did talk, you want to eat all. And I, I really do not get what Nengi was saying, seriously, because Nengi. Is a funny girl, seriously. I want this more than anything. Though, I don't know how to be like more than anything. Mm -hmm. Are you hungry? Mm -hmm. I actually feel like it's a bit of chicken. What? What do you want to say? Don't kill me. Oh. Oh. <laughs> no? Then moving on, guys. The Today, during the OPPO challenge, because OPPO came again, yeah, this time I don't know what, whether it's a two round something you get. Housemates were, were giving shout out by their fans, like they played it on the screen for them, and you need to see the jubilation. You know, when you're just in some sort of a, a, a place, a confined space where you don't know what is happening, you keep imagining, and all of a sudden it's as if you're seeing or you're hearing a glimpse of what is actually happening. The excitement was so much. In fact, New Zone was on top of the roof. Seriously. Hi, I'm Billy Goldie from the I'm here to say shout out to you guys. I want to tell you that we love you. We this way we are supporting you. Oh, confidence. Keep doing you, baby girl. Thank you, Oppo, for the opportunity. Bye. Give it to a vote. Neil went on top of the roof like he was screaming, yelling out of excitement. So that's just it, guys. I just I just know how exciting or how happy you can be when you realize that you've not been hearing from people, or when you know that people are out there rooting for you, people are out there supporting you, people are out there like cheering you off. Even Dorothy the Explorer, you, you need to see how she was excited knowing her her gang name you get you get, and that was just basically what happened yesterday. So me just feel like eh, make I can't tell you say all the suspicion where we suspect about Erica. Say Erica do this or Erica do that. All that suspicion about today. Erica has actually confirmed it with her mouth that she has done the undo. I don't know how to say she has done the worst in the HOH lounge with Kid Wire. And even she said she did shame for what she do. She no go feel watch what she don't do. So only God knows what Kyle they really hid from us. Only God knows what Kyle they did not show us. Because like I always say, 600 years for Kyle day because Kyle day has really slid us. Kyle day cheated us. Kyle day refused. When LM, Erica was head of house and could uh, they could allow um, Kid Wire to be there, Kyle they refused to show the head, the head of house lounge automatically. So they had the privilege to do their worst. They had the privilege to do whatever they wanted to do. And that was just it. So I just felt like, let me bring this just to you guys. Like I report it as it is hot. So don't think that it's because I'm saying it because it's Erica. Because if it was Nengi that did it, I will come here and I will tell you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please, if you do, give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment in the comment section. I really love to hear read from you guys. And please, 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 guys, go check me out on my personal channel, Vicky M E 
um, the link is always in the description and pinned in the comment section please go support your girl show me all the love that you can on that channel i really really appreciate it thank you so very much for watching my video i will most definitely see you guys in my next one